Hey everybody, what's good? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I had the idea to do a camera test between the iPhone 3G and the iPhone 10. So this here is an iPhone 3G, which is the second iPhone ever made. However, the camera on it is basically the same as the first generation iPhone. So you could basically say that we are doing a camera test between the first iPhone camera and the newest iPhone camera. So this will be pretty interesting. I'm going to go take some photos and videos with these phones, and then we will compare. But first of all, let's take a look at the camera apps on both of these. So, like I said, this is the same camera as the iPhone 2G. However, you do get one additional feature here on the iPhone 3G, since this phone supports iOS 4 and the iPhone 2G does not, which is this digital zoom slider right here, which looks pretty crappy, but hey, you get one additional feature. Um, the camera app itself is very basic. There is no features whatsoever. There's no autofocus or tap to focus or even tap to adjust exposure and there's no flash, nothing like that. And there's not even a video recording mode. Now I know I said earlier in the video that I was going to be recording videos with these two phones and this phone does not record videos. But luckily we have the ability to jailbreak these phones and I will be installing a video recorder and we will use that. So going back to the camera app, again super simple, you basically just take a photo and you're done. Um, the actual camera itself on here is a 2 megapixel camera, um, which was pretty crappy by today's standards, but back then it was actually pretty good. Um, most phones had 2 megapixel cameras back then. And the video recorder that I'm going to be using on this um, is a really weird resolution. It is 288 by 384 or 288p, if that's a thing. Um, so yeah, a weird resolution, just a little bit better than 240p. And then it's going to be about 9.1 frames per second, but um, I think the frame rate can actually like change throughout the video, so it's like between 6 and 15 frames per second, which is really crappy. Um, so yeah, um, that's the iPhone 3G, and now moving on to the iPhone 10. So this camera is absolutely amazing. Um, it is 12.2 megapixels, which is like 6 times the resolution the iPhone 3G and it has not one but two cameras, well three if you count the front facing camera, which the iPhone 3G also does not have, but there's two cameras on the back which allow for some pretty cool features like this optical zoom here, oops, um, so yeah, and you can also do portrait mode which is super, super snazzy, um, but yeah, apart from that you get a ton of other features, you have autofocus, as well as tap to adjust focus and exposure. You also have exposure control, um, focus and exposure lock. You've got um, the grid lines here, as you can see. Actually, I don't know if you can see that, but you have the grid. And then, of course, you have your little camera flash right there. You've got HDR mode. You've got live photos, timer mode. You've got these filters as well, which is pretty neat. Um, and then you have all these other photo modes. So you have portrait, like I said. You have all these portrait lighting effects. And then you've got your square mode. You've got panorama. And then for video, you've got your regular video mode. You've got slow-mo video. You've got time-lapse. So this camera is absolutely feature-packed. Um, and I forgot to mention, the camera can record up to 4K 60 frames per second video, which is absolutely ridiculous, um, which is like 10 times the resolution of this, or something like that. Um, so yeah, absolutely crazy. Um, so we'll be testing these out, and um, I guess I'm just going to put in the photos I took, and as well as the videos. So yeah.
so this is the iPhone 10 video sample. We're recording at 4K 60 frames per second, although I don't think my video editor supports 4K at 60, so this will probably be 4K 30. But uh, yeah, um, you can also get an idea of the optical image stabilization. So yeah, it looks pretty, pretty good. So now let's move over to the iPhone 3G. Okay, so now we're recording on the iPhone 3G at 288 by 384, which is a weird resolution. And then the frame rate is between 6 and 15. I don't know, it's weird. Um, so yeah, it probably looks pretty crappy. But you didn't even get a video recorder on this thing when it came out. So, yeah, that's what that looks like. So that's pretty much it for this camera comparison between the iPhone 3G and the iPhone 10. Obviously from these photos and videos you can tell that the iPhone 3G's camera is much, much better than the iPhone 10. Uh, just kidding guys, the iPhone 10 is like 50,000 times better. Um, so yeah, that is what a difference 10 years makes, or I guess 10 and a half years at this point. Absolutely mind blown. So uh, yeah, um, I really hope you enjoyed this video, and also a heads up, I am going to be deleting, well not deleting, but I'm going to ma be making some of my like really old trashy videos, I'm going to make them unlisted, however I'll still keep them on my channel, so I'll make like a playlist for that, um, so you can still watch them if you want, which you don't want to, but um, yeah, I'm just going to be cleaning up my channel a little bit, so yeah, some of my trashier videos will be going into that playlist um so yeah i just thought i'd give you guys a heads up but that is it for this video thank you guys so much for watching and subscribing and peace